Welcome to Journey Family Church. It's good to be here. For one thing, I never experienced anything like we are experiencing today. A lot of fear going around and worrying about what is going to be happening later on in the world today. There is so much sadness. Is life worth living, we hear people say? So much uncertainty concerning the future. Our plans, yes, and even our plans with a new church being built. My mind went to a gospel song that was written by Bill and Gloria Gaither during the time of the Vietnam War and the drug culture was booming and the God is dead theory was popular. That's when uh, Bill and Gloria Gaither were experiencing uh, a baby. And they thought this is a poor time to bring a baby into the world. But then their first son was born. At times they felt discouraged. They wondered what, why did we go about this? But then as they saw their newborn son, they held him in their arms. Then the words to a verse for this new song that they had been writing came to their mind. How sweet to hold a newborn baby and feel the pride and joy he gives. But better still, the calm assurance that this child can face on certain days. And here's the reason, because Christ lives. And the excitement came to them because Christ lives, we can face tomorrow. This is why I am encouraged today. I need to ask myself today, and as the days go by, is Christ alive? Does he live today? Are we serving a living savior? Can we say from our hearts, Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord, the Lord who cannot lie, the eternal one, the unchanging one, is my shepherd. What does a shepherd do? What is a shepherd's role? Listen, a shepherd leads his sheep. A shepherd guides the sheep. A shepherd guards the sheep. He loves the sheep. He provides for the sheep and he protects the sheep. And what a comfort for me over the past several years. A shepherd pursues, he searches, for his sheep that may have wandered off. He restores the wanderer. You can recognize Jesus' sheep. How can we recognize them? They hear his voice and they follow him. Not so people will obey it out of obligation or fear, but to assure his children, his sheep, of their relationship with him and guide them home. Psalm 119 verse 105 says, Thy word is a lamp unto my feet and a light to my path. In John 10, 27, Jesus says, My sheep hear my voice and I know them and they follow me. God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of love and of a sound mind. Remember, because he lives, we can face tomorrow. God bless you.